Microsoft Teams is a powerful tool that many users can benefit from. They just don't know how. When you first start using the application, you may feel a little overwhelmed, which often leads us to play it safe and not truly explore this application. This video will help you uncover and unlock some of the amazing features that has made a Teams lover out of me. I'm not sure if you knew this, but Teams is not just for teamwork. With a name like Teams, it's easy to assume we can only benefit from this application when we're working on projects, need to chat with others, or are collaborating with colleagues. Yes, Teams is extremely helpful in all of these situations. However, Teams was designed to benefit every type of user, from those who rely heavily on teamwork to sole contributors and organizations. Leveraging the Files view in Teams allows a user to access all of the important files that they've recently worked on or shared from the Office 365 environment. Your files are divided into three categories, Recent, Microsoft Teams, and Downloads. Recents will show you every Office 365 document that you have viewed or edited recently. You can view the date that you've last modified the document and its current location. Use the ellipsis beside the document to open and edit, download, or even copy a shareable link to this document that allows you to share it with others. Selecting Microsoft Teams will allow you to view all of the documents that have been created or modified by yourself or by others across the Teams environment. You can view when the document was most recently modified, who has modified it, and where the document is currently being stored. Use the ellipsis beside the document to open and edit, download, or copy a shareable link to this document, allowing you to share it with others. Selecting Downloads will allow you to access all of the files that you've downloaded from Teams. Traditionally, you would have to navigate to the File Explorer to access items that you've downloaded. However, the Downloads section allows you to access the downloads without leaving the Teams environment. Choosing Open Downloads folder is going to allow you to access the download folder in your File Explorer if you needed it. And now the reason that you're able to spend the majority of your workday immersed in the Teams environment, the Files view allows you to access your OneDrive cloud storage. You can also add other cloud storage services that you use throughout your workday. Since Teams is integrated with other applications, it is possible to complete personal work items while staying connected to others without leaving the Teams environment. Click the item to open it and review it, or choose the ellipsis beside the document name to explore some options to help you manage the document. You have three options for editing. Open online, open in the application, or edit in Teams. You can select edit in Teams, which would allow you to open and edit your document using the online version of the application within the Teams environment. This allows you to stay connected to others while working on your document in the Teams environment. You can open and access all of the views within the navigation pane, as well as access the features and functions of the navigation bar. As you're working on personal items within the Teams environment, you can message others without leaving your current view. Navigate to your search bar and type the at symbol and then the name of a user that you'd like to connect with. Hit tab and begin typing a private message. When you're ready, send the instant message by selecting enter. When the user replies, it will appear as a banner in the bottom right hand corner of your screen. You can reply to that user from here as well. As always, no information is ever lost in Teams. You can access these messages from the chat view within the Teams environment. The ellipsis view in Teams allows you to access other Microsoft applications that you already know, love, and use. From here, you can access your personal notebooks from OneNote or your personal tasks from within Planner. Simply click the application you'd like to access and work on and it will open within the Teams environment. This allows you to get more done while remaining connected to others in your organization. There are so many amazing ways that Teams can work for you in your organization. For more Office 365 tips and tricks, don't forget to subscribe to this channel.